Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do your mid-September 2018 general reading. It's a general reading, so it will not resonate with everyone who's view who views the video, but if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Um, let's get started. Um, energetic, energetically, I feel like someone wants to talk to you, Libra. Someone wants to come back from the past. They caused a lot of hurt, a lot of frustration. It could be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Scorpio and Cancer highlighted. Um, they just cause a lot of mental and emotional confusion. There's a lot of history there. There's also a fire sign uh, or Gemini wanting to come back from the past. So let's get started. That's in regards to relationship, but this is a general read. So, you know, this could talk about career. This could talk about family situations. I mean, health, anything. Okay. All right. So let's get started. A lot of you are like, you know, kind of like standoffish, apprehensive. That's Ace of Swords keeps coming off me. In regards to someone coming back, you got to be clear. You got to communicate clearly. Be assertive in your communication. You can't be roundabout and don't be as indecisive as sometimes the Libra can be. Uh, stop trying to see the good in people, especially when you know they're bad or they're bad for you or the good in a situation where you know it just doesn't pan out well for you, Libra. Walk away. Uh, there's that fire sign. Um, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Sagittarius highlighted here. Um, the star card, some of you dealing with Aquarius, Six of Pentacles, Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords. Lots of feminine energy. Um, Libra can feel like they put in a lot of energy, effort, time, money into a situation. They just want to give their side of a situation um, of how maybe they feel slighted they feel tricked in, in maybe in regards to a marriage situation in which they're trying to cut out or a business you're, be assertive in what you want to speak and what you want to say to, to whomever uh, they'll appreciate it and so will you Li Libra um, say what you need to say in regards to this situation some of you um, there's another woman in a marriage situation or somebody interfering in a business relationship it's just interference here yeah page of pentacle um, this could have something to do with your children Libra if not it's the fact that someone is building or has started to build elsewhere. They they be, began something elsewhere. This came out reverse. None of these cards are reverse. Six of sword in reverse. Some you, I feel like Libra can't get past a situation because they haven't spoken exactly how to feel. You know, you can't get past it. You can't get to mental clarity. Uh, you may try to talk to this person and they shut you out or they shut you down. Yeah. Um, I think everything just kind of hits the fan in regards to... Um, the tower here what is this tower about yeah somebody moving or walking away not moving emotionally checked out somebody just abandoned ship here and they did it sneaking like they, they snuck away they made a plan and they went in a new direction they started to build elsewhere they left behind the partnership. This could be that fire sign, Libra. It could be any sign, but it makes you have heavy anxi anxiety about this person and the situation. It could be somebody younger than you. 
Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, a child. Then the King of Cups comes out. Yeah, that's just arguing and bickering. Um, you keep you guys keep butting heads. And then the Five of Swords, nothing but argument, bickering. Um, maybe with an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. in regards to a business or some entrepreneurship or something you know um, creative that you did or you do self-employment is highlighted here some of you just want to give a message to maybe your better half uh, spouse or whomever that you feel like you put into so much energy so much time effort money into this relationship you feel drained you feel stuck you haven't been speaking your truth you haven't been assertive you haven't communicated some of you it's a business relationship uh, you want to tell maybe a business partner with the cards the advice of the cards is say what you have to say but if you can't say what you have to say have the, the courage and the strength to move on and find rest and peace balance again and knowing that you are over this and out of it that this is an end to this cycle but in everything well in all things speak your truth because it'll give you a sense of closure it's like you, you've got all these emotions bottled up and you're not saying what it is you want to say. Let's see. So this is the Angel Answers deck. If you have questions out there, formulate them in your mind and here are your answers. Okay. Communicate clearly. <laughs> Okay, clearly didn't have I mean, I say I've been saying that. Look for a sign. You're ready. Seems like you are not the right time. Okay. Conflicting. It's up to you. Trust the bottom of the deck. Um whatever this is, you gonna have to speak your truth if you can, write it out. If the person won't allow you to talk to them. If talking turns into argument and no one is being heard, you have to just live with the fact that, you know, you tried and, and move on. Know that this is the end of an era, end of a cycle here. This could be in regards to business, relationship, marriage. Um, how you feel about another person coming back, offering the opportunity to... Um, Offering loving messages, the sweet nothings right here. Maybe this Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio person that you have heavy conflict with. Let's see. All right, sobriety. Now, for some of you, this is, of course, a strong drink. That's the Bible says, right? Um, of course, this is chemical and, and uh, um, what is it? Chemical, um, you know, intoxication uh, or the misuse of any chemical substance, chem uh, abuse. Uh, you need to get in control of that. If you have any habits that alter your sobriety, alter your way of thinking, you need to change your mind about you know um this being a way of life for you maybe you need to 
come up with some different habits, some, some better habits, or at least try to shift and, and you gotta have to um okay I'm hearing some of you need it needs you need to have more sober thoughts like your mind is everywhere and you have so much influence and it's not the right influence it's negative it may be immature not well thought out so change your mind about who you're speaking with you are stronger than you know the strength card here parental care keep the faith all right so um some of you you have children or you need to go back with to your parent and um maybe uh involve yourself in the care of your aging parent keep the faith in whatever it is you're trying to manifest in your life whatever it is you're trying to do know that you are strong some of you just changing your mind about a situation completely it might be in regards to a love offer or love messages that come in uh, yeah relationship dynamics at the bottom of the deck uh, it might have something to do with maybe this person not being in the best energy and light in the past and dealing with them if, if there is history or if it's a new person you're seeing there's some red flags here and the dynamics of the of the relationship are um are changing or have changed because now you see and, and now you're changing your mind about this particular person it, they are never going to change or situation is never going to change okay so let's do a yes or no spread for Libra um the yes or no spread you can get this done for yourself it's of course um the yes or no question and it's ten dollars just one question you want to know is he coming back um is she gone for good did I leave my keys you know, under the sofa, I don't know, whatever. Um, let's see. What does Lib should Libra allow the person from the past to come back? Should Libra allow the person from the past, the person that they have history, history with, to come back? Should Libra allow the person from the past to come back? Let's see. Okay, we got the hanged man in the upright that says, yes, you should um, look at this situation from a different perspective. Six of swords in the upright. Move away from the conflict and the drama. Maybe this person means well. Nine of pentacles in reverse. Ooh, maybe this person wants to take you off the market, Libra. Okay, the moon in reverse. Wow, and this governs Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Um... It looks like whatever was hidden is going to come to light. Maybe if this person has secrets and or just outright lies, it's coming all out. They're, they're willing to clear the air. So, there you are, Libra. Yes, you should allow this person to come back. It looks good. Okay. Libra moon. Good, good. All right, Libra. Um, if you need a personal reading or just want a yes or no spread, send me an email. My email address is below. Go over to the website and book for yourself. Or a book of full reading. It's much appreciated. Thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure you're commenting below. Liking the post. Um, know that I'm praying for you. Leave a pray for me as well. Take care. Until the next time.